Alright, here's something that I haven't seen in a while. MTV Remote Control for the NES. This is my fourth game of my run. And I hit the pause button by accident. Anyways. Let's go to number four. More MTV. What year did MTV premiere? 1982, I think. Oh! Well, never mind, I did hit the button, but I was wrong. Not 1980. So I was one year too bent off. Too many. Yeah, 1981. Channel 5 now. Channel number 5. One stage is said to look beautiful. Now I have to memorize all those big words. These are models turned actors. Alright. Her father got famous singing Calypso music, but this model made it big on the TV series Hotel. Name her. Uh, not Valerie Belafonte. Sherry Belafonte Harper. I'm not starting off too well. Alright, wrestling channel. Is it a sport? Is it a Sam? Who really cares? <laughs> he was a nasty, slimy wrestling referee. Now he's a nasty, slimy wrestler. Who is he? Dangerous Danny Davis, final victor in Venice. Dangerous Danny Davis is who we needed. Ooh, got a good answer. Did you skip a lot of school as a kid? Well, I can't speak for her, but I know I didn't skip any school. Alright, let's see what Lauren picks. Sticking with wrestling. What wrestler regularly has the phrase, don't be cruel, stitched across his tights? The Honky Tonk Man, Bobby the Brain, Hulk Hogan. I'll say Hulk Hogan. No, not Hulk Hogan. The Honky Tonk Man. Yeah, I'm not starting off too well. Well, hopefully things will improve here. Not that they keep picking wrestling. Whenever Coco Beware enters the ring, he brings his pal Frankie with him. What exactly is Frankie? A trained bird, a deadly snake, a trained monkey. A trained bird. Well, I think we're done with wrestling now. Yeah, I think, yeah we're done with wrestling. Who played the villainous killed by 007 and never say never again? And then played Angelica Nero on TV's Dallas. Uh, Barbara Carrera? There we go! I finally got one right! One 1970s cover girl played the older woman in the summer 42, Jennifer Keene, Jennifer O'Neill, or Jennifer Jones. Not Jennifer Keaton. Is it Jennifer O'Neill? Yes it is! Alright, I go to 25 points. The Cartoon Channel. These are questions about characters who tell jokes, fall off cliffs, talk funny, and generally behave as silly as we wish we all could. <laughs> what cartoon family would take their dinner out of a machine called the food arachis cycle? The Osmonds, the Jetsons, the Flintstones. Uh, the Jetsons? Yes! Wow, your brain must have been swollen and dropping to pull off the answer. Not really. Alright, tie for the lead now, and let's stick with that one. On what TV show might you see a cartoon donkey dancing about on Junior Sandals' head? Kiwi's Playhouse? No, 
and I was on a roll, too. Not the Benny Hill show, so that leaves just Hee Haw. Great answer. You think I might be able to hire you as a writer? More prime time. On Designing Women, how many times has Femme Fatale, Suzanne Sugarbaker, been married? Three, five, or never? Not never. Alright, I'll take a guess. Three times? Yes! Once stuttering Barnard Animal avoided becoming bacon and made a career saying, That's all, folks. Pig pen, porky pig, or tantrific, it's porky pig. That's all, folks. Oh, yeah, classic Clooney Tunes. Alright, I'm now in the lead and I have as many points as the other two players combined. Private eyes. They peek through windows and hide in closets. They're not weirdos, they're private investigators. Name the actress, once known as Cheryl Stoppelmore, who replaced Farrah Fawcett on Charlie's Angels. Cheryl Teeks, Cheryl Hack, or Cheryl Ladd? Not Cheryl Teeks. Not Hack. That means Cheryl Ladd, but time is out. Alright. So no points for anybody on that one. Let's go over to number three. The Bewitch channel. Maurice was which character's natural father? Larry Tate, Darren Stevens, Samantha Stevens. Samantha Stevens? And time's up for round one, which means snap break time. Alright, so at the end of the first round, I have 55 points, second place has 40, and third place has 10. Alright, I'm gonna go to round two, point values are doubled. Whatever happened to? Old actors never die, they just find more demeaning roles to play. He dropped into semi-obscurity to study occult and sell felt tip pens and fan club merchandise, but he, he thinks this Batman's boy wonder. Name him Burt Coffee, Gary Ward, Burt Ward. Uh, Gary Ward? Okay, uh, I did not mean to say Burt Ward, but uh, I ended up uh, getting it right, so. Eh. Alright, boy, they were stupid. Last season I asked these questions to a bunch of blockheads who didn't know their answers. Let's see if you're any smarter. <laughs> On MASH, what's Blade R. O'Reilly's first name? Walter, Henry, or Frank? It's Walter. Yeah, no. The question before this, I meant to put the second answer, not the third one, but uh, it ended up being a good mistake, otherwise I would have been wrong. Anyways, on the Flintstones, Fred and Barney had a little green pal from space. What was his name? Lord of the Space Fiend, the little gremlin, the Great Gazoo. The Great Gazoo! Okay. Desi Arnaz skyrocketed to fame, playing a Cuban band leader on I Love Lucy. What did Desi do for a living before Lucy first aired in 1951? Cuban band leader, Cuban taxi driver, Cuban cigar maker. Cuban band leader. Oh, go figure. 
Alright, Lauren's in control. Point number three, prime prime time. She's got it, she flaunts it, and she drives Mary Jenkins nuts. Name the resident vamp on prime times 227. Sandra Rosalie Mary. I'll say Sandra. Yes! Whoa, are you related to Einstein or something? Uh, not really. But I am up to 95 points. Name the Rock'em Sock'em character Lee Majors plays in The Fall Guy. Tom Seaver, Colt Seavers, or Jason Seaver? It's not Tom Seaver. Is it Colt Seavers? Yes, it is. You, my friend, are indeed super genius. Well, I don't know about that. I mean, you could get the first three questions I buzzed in on wrong. What is the name of Deacon on Amen? It is Fry, Deacon Jones, Ruben Gregory. Ernest Fry. And player freeze at 80 points. That being Susan. The Cosby Show. On Cosby, name the college that Cliff, Claire, and Russell Huxtable graduated. Hillman, Temple, Ups. Hillman. Okay, after 125, and let's stick with the same category here. On Cosby, she's the mother of the Huxtable client and Cliff's loving wife. But can you name Felicia Rashad's real life husband? Mom Rashad, Muhammad Rashad, Irv Cross. It's a Mom Rashad. Watch with a glow for that fine, fine answer. It should be even more impressive how quickly I said that answer. Name Sandra's new husband on The Cosby Show. Alvin, Melvin, or Elvin? Elvin. Elvin! <laughs> no, that doesn't really sound right. Alright, let's go to number five. Bald guys. These are people who are shining examples in their fields, but the light catches their heads right. Answer these questions about celebrity... Okay, I didn't get to read the last part. Bing Bone and Balding after Big Tabat played short order quote Mel Sharples on popular sitcom. My sister Sam, Alice, and Flex. Alice? Yes. Okay, up to 185. Number six, please. Hogan's Heroes. On Hogan's Heroes, the Bo and Newkirk held the same military rank. Name the rank. Corporal, Major, or Private? It's not Major. I'll say Corporal. Yes! It's Corporal. Alright, up to 195. Number 7. More reruns. <laughs> Let me run enough of those. The Carol Burnett Show featured a long-running soap opera parody called As the What Turns. Oh, okay, not the world. What? Not the head. It's gotta be the stomach. Yep, yeah, it's the stomach. And for the record, As the World Turns is a real soap opera. How many kids did Rhoda and Joe have together? Two, none or one. I'll say that they had two. Ah! Well, it wasn't two. It was none. on that. He froze a couple of times and that but anyway, movie channel now. Before they edited and interrupted by commercial, some movies actually play in theaters. Wow. Oh, never mind, 
I keep hitting the pause button. In one movie did five Brad Pat stars all have to show for Saturday attention. Breakfast Club, Fast Times, it's the Breakfast Club! That's what I was trying to say. Ugh. I think something happened with my controller here. Well, the buttons got reversed on me. Off the air! So Lauren is out of the game. Celebrate screen check and the titles of hit movies will replace one word for the U.S. president. Okay. Here we go. questions, which uh, caused me to not be able to answer, but uh, I think something happened with my controller that caused me to not be able to answer, but that's alright. Anyways, we'll see you for the next game.